What up streamers, I'm Streamers Playbook and I'm here to make your streams come true baby. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to add your bits badges on Twitch. Now this is something I'm pretty sure you probably have never seen. I barely found out about this and it's a cool little unique feature that you could add to your stream. Let's go and hop into this. But before we do, if you like these overlays up there, own.tv, best overlays, emails, transitions in the business, link in the description, check them out. So first what we wanna do is go up here to your profile icon, go ahead and click it. Now go to your creator dashboard. And on this left hand side, go to settings and then go to affiliate. Now you have to be a Twitch affiliate or a Twitch partner in order to do this, all right? Now scroll down and you wanna to go to this section here where it says bits tier badges. Now you've probably seen these badges on Twitch before, right? For people who have donated a certain amount of bits, they'll get this special badge. But did you know you can actually edit those badges? I did not know that. So what you would do is let's say I wanna edit the 10K badge, go ahead and click edit. And then what you would want to do is you have to upload three different images, just like uploading a sub badge. I'll put a link how to, up to upload sub badges bo below in case you're curious. But I would like to use stream, stream, stream frogs. So go ahead and I would click on them and then I would go down to where it says subscriber badge resizer. I'd upload my image here and then it'll give me uh, like here, look it, I'll show you. So if I upload my, my badge here, let's go a thumbnail, edit, upload this one right here, subscriptions, thumbnails. And it gives the different sizes. If I click on it, each one, it'll download it, right? And then I'll go over here to my Twitch and I would just upload these different images. So like this is the 72, this is the 36, right? Except in the 18. And then once I do all that, go ahead and click save. And now you're gonna see that this is the new badge, right? It's the little picture that I put on there. Now, there's some pros, but there's also some cons to doing this. Let me give you the pros. The pros is this is super cool and different and unique. So it could be something for your viewers to be like, wow, wow, I like that. They have a super cool badge for me donating 10,000 bits or 20,000, whatever. I want to earn that. Super cool. All right. And I agree. It is cool. But on the other hand, what these badges right here are like pretty iconic. And I see even the big streamers a lot of times just keep these generic badges. Even though they don't stand out as much, people in the streams will recognize, oh, this, this person is a, you know, 5,000 sub or a 5,000 bit donator, 25,000, even all the way up to what it says, 4.5 million down here, 5 million. So those are kind of the pros and cons. On the one hand, it's like more unique to your channel, to your brand, people could work for it. On the other hand, in some of the bigger channels, uh, they might not recognize people, it, like people might not recognize your unique badges. They might be like, oh, what the heck is that? They might not understand it. Now, if you want to get rid of the badge that you just uploaded, what you'd want to do, so like this one right here, go over, click edit, and then you just click reset to default and then save changes and then boom, we go back up here. It's back to the 10K original badge that it was. One last thing I wanna show you, if you don't want like a certain tier to even be displayed, you could just turn it off here. So if I just turn it off, there's no badge for the 10,000. Remember, I'm coming out with streaming tips Monday through Friday to help you with your streams. If you're into streaming, I promise I have something to help you with the stream. So hit the sub button so you don't miss. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.